Do you know what the average cost of a web designer is? Research shows you're looking at $50 to $200 per hour. That price is just way out of range for a lot of small businesses and people looking to set up their own website. Website builders, they're your fix here. They can cost as little as $2.99 a month. Sure, prices vary, but they're so much cheaper. And the control of your site is properly in your hands. You want to update the products you sell, change how your homepage looks, add a blog or a seasonal promotion. That's all at your fingertips in seconds with the Rye Website Builder. And if you're looking at your fingertips with doubt, let me stop you. Yes, even you can build a website. These platforms are built with beginners in mind. You don't need to know any code or be especially tech savvy. They'll guide you through every step of the way. So, where to start? There are so many website builders to choose from. Knowing which one to go for can be pretty confusing, but today I'll try to help you out by talking through what works best for different cases. There's no one size fits all on this. In this video, we'll help you find your perfect website builder match by comparing five of the biggest names on the market. If you choose to go with any of the builders that are on our list, you gotta check out the links in the description below the video for a sweet discount. And if you want your decision made even easier, we've added a quick quiz in the description too which will help make sure your needs are perfectly matched with the right setup. The last thing before we start off, it would be super cool if you could tap that subscribe button if you haven't already. We'll bring you the best tips and recommendations for all your tech questions. Okay then, getting started on the good stuff. Our fifth place spot in the world of website builders for small businesses goes to Square Online. A bit of history on this one. Square, a big name and point of sale systems, acquired Weebly, a big name in website builders in 2018. Square then used Weebly software to make Square Online, throwing their hat in the ring of e-commerce platforms. Today, over 40 million websites are powered by Square, and there's a good reason for it. So, why do so many people use it, and what's the main reason Square Online is making their list? Well, it's their free plan. Who doesn't love free? It's honestly the best free option on the market if you're an e-commerce business. It comes with unlimited bandwidth and has some solid features. If you're already working with the Square system for your POS, this could be for you. On the free plan, there's incredibly no limit on how many products or items you can upload to the website you craft. That limitless inventory gives you freedom in changing your offering and making sure your online store is up to date. Square's free plan covers your bases on the SEO basic side of things, so you can get your website found in Google search. It includes an SSL certificate and fields for meta name and description. Nothing to shout about, but good to know you're covered. Other features of the free plan here include pick up or click and collect functionality, which is a base requirement for a lot of service-based industries. And you can create multiple Square Online sites for free, which is a big plus. You're probably wondering, what's the catch? Well, although this free plan is the best we've seen, the advice I always hand out when people ask me about free options for website builders is to upgrade from that free plan as soon as you can. Why? Well, of course you get what you pay for, and the best features and perks are always reserved for paying customers. So, sure, Square has the best free plan out there, but skip it if you can. If you level up from it, you're looking at so many more features that are pretty essential for your site. We all know that to build trust with your customers, you need good products. And how do your customers know they're good? Reviews. With the upgraded plans on Square, you can build in a product review feature which builds trust in your brand and products for people looking to buy. You won't get that on the free version. Other customizations with paid Square Online plans include the ability to add video and social media content, which helps build more trust and brand awareness with your customers. They can see true representations of your products, and if they see you active on socials, they're only going to back you more and buy more to what you're creating. Your domain is also included on the paid plans here. That's the custom address you type in to find your website. If you don't upgrade, then your website address will need to be something like mybiz.square.site instead of something punchy like mybiz.com. What's more, you have the ability to embed custom code with the paid plans too, if you do have that tech-savvy friend or existing skills in this area. You can really make your online store your own in every way. If you need support with your site, Square Online's phone-based support is available to everyone, free users and premium users alike, but there's no around-the-clock support like other providers offer. It would be great to see Square Online increase its customer support hours soon. Some customers also complain that the design functionality isn't great. There are limited options and no real templates to speak of, so so you might need to start your site design from scratch, which is a big ask for a business owner with limited time. Pricing. What are you looking at? Well, you've of course got the free plan we've gone through already, but outside of that, Square Online offers two other paid plans. The Plus plan retails at $29 per month, and the premium is $79 a month. There's also differences when it comes to the processing fees you'll get charged for any sales made through your Square Online website. Broken down, the free plan has limited customization, as we've spoken about, and transaction fees cost 2.9% plus 30 cents 
that will be deducted from each sale you make. The Plus plan opens the door to customization with loads more features, but transaction fees still cost that 2.9% plus 30 cents per transaction. The Premium plan gives you all the customization and features of the Plus plan, along with cheaper processing fees at 2.6% plus 30 cents per transaction. Ultimately, the price points for Square Online are pretty solid. The free plan is a good starting point for a business finding its feet. But to get real use from the platform, you'll want to jump on the paid plans, which provide slicker features. If you're using Square already, it could be the easiest way for you to get online and boost your sales beyond your local area. But keep an open mind, and remember, we're still at number five on our list. Moving on to fourth place in our bracket, based out of Lithuania, we have Hostinger. As a company, they hit their stride in 2021, reaching 1,000 employees worldwide as well as being listed in Yahoo's hosting market report as one of the main players in hosting online content. This website builder is best for complete beginners. If you're a small business or individual who is especially anxious about the complications of putting yourself out there on the internet or you have really limited tech infrastructure, Hostinger could be for you. The best thing when you're working in Hostinger is how damn simple it is to use. It's a drag and drop platform with templates that work in simple grids. Anybody in your team will be able to pick up how to build with it in no time. What can make it even easier to use? It's AI Web Builder. The functionality generates copy and images super quickly, which saves you loads of time when building your website. And if you need it, the AI can even whip you up a logo or help you come up with a domain name. If you want your whole site made for you, it can do that too, in just three steps. The most impressive AI feature, in my opinion, is for sure the heat mapping tool. It helps you see where your users are clicking, meaning you can change your design as directed by the people visiting your site. If people are landing on your site and clicking a logo that doesn't go anywhere, you can see it on the heat map and update your site to link out. It's a sweet feature, a real insight into user behavior. I'm telling you, businesses usually pay a lot of money to get that kind of feature. Different to the rest of the website builders on our list, Hostinger, although a really strong website builder, is actually better known for its web hosting service. This is the behind the scenes setup that essentially provides your site a spot on the internet and covers all your bases when it comes to getting online. But hold up, Hostinger has got the AI side of things sorted. It's easy to use, it's technically sound, so, where does it fall down? It's lacking in integrations. It's very much its own island. Hostinger doesn't have an app store and doesn't integrate with any marketplaces. That means no Amazon, Etsy, or eBay, and there's no way to integrate it with a POS system or email marketing either. This could spell trouble if you're looking at e-commerce as your main priority or considering selling online in the future. You can still sell items if you opt for the business plan, but only through the website itself. With these limitations, if you have a physical store right now, Hostinger probably isn't for you. There's also no free trial or plan, which means you really have to know what you're committing to when you jump into Hostinger. Speaking of pricing, like I said, there are no free options, which, hey, sometimes isn't the worst thing if you look back at my Square Online review. Although nothing's free, Hostinger does offer the most affordable website builder plan in comparison to its competitors. The premium website builder plan costs just $11.99 per month, which is pretty cheap for what you get and that might be everything you need. On top of this, there's also now a business website builder plan, which I mentioned before, that costs $13.99 per month. The main difference? The business plan offers e-com capability of up to 500 products and premium doesn't. Again, that's for making sales on site only, so it can't be connected with Amazon, Etsy, or the like, but that won't matter if you're not selling online through those sites already. If you think Hostinger might work for you, check out the promo code in our description and you can actually save on your subscription. On top of an already low starting price, we can help you save even more cash. To round up Hostinger, this tool makes it as easy as possible to set up a website, but it has minimal customization options and limited e-commerce options too. Well, you've got to choose the business plan if you're an e-com. Even the business plan is missing some key features, most importantly an app store, but if speed, ease of use, and affordability are important to you, Hostinger could still be your best bet. Up next and third, we have Shopify. If you're a small business and you're selling online for the first time, Shopify could be a good match for you. The whole setup of Shopify is perfect for e-commerce. It's less about the look of your site and more about the functionality here. If you're not in e-commerce, definitely skip Shopify. The sales and marketing features are really in a league of their own here. When you set up your site with Shopify, the process focuses on the products you're going to sell, not your actual design. There's a whole range of apps that you can add to your site to help build out its functionality exactly as you want it. Apps like Cart Whisperer, which sends pop-ups to a user if they're about to exit, and Smile, which creates a loyalty program for your site visitors, help to cater a bespoke offering to your audience. These apps 
chats are just super helpful and there are literally hundreds of them from live chat apps to product reviews. They make selling online easy. Something else to flag, unlike Hostinger, Shopify offers multi-platform integrations with platforms like Amazon and eBay. That means your small business can reach customers wherever they are. Did you know? A recent report found that multi-channel customers have a 15 to 35% higher average transaction than single channel shoppers, resulting in a 30% higher lifetime value. If you're in e-commerce, it makes sense to have those multi-channel integrations set up for your business. Once a purchase has been made on your site, Shopify makes it easy for you to track and analyze sales. You can learn from your customers and build your business around the trends you're seeing in real time. Okay, so the last last killer feature with Shopify I want to highlight is what it has on offer in terms of AI. I've mentioned it with Hostinger too, the recent uptick in AI working with these builders is a game changer. Shopify Magic is an AI tool Shopify can boast about. It's integrated super deeply on your site and has a lot of tricks up its sleeve. From generating product descriptions to suggesting email content for when you want to promote your products to your mailing list, and even image manipulation, there's a lot it has to offer here that can automatically improve your web presence. The only AI it loses out to in this market is what Wix has on offer, but but we'll get to that later. There are some really strong areas for Shopify, but just one main area where it falls down. Drum roll, please. It's price. It's pretty expensive. There are four plans starting at $29 a month with the basic plan. It has just two staff accounts and four inventory locations. It works for smaller businesses just starting out, but nothing bigger than that. You'll want to graduate to the self-titled Shopify plan, coming in at $79 per month if you're a bigger team as it gives you five additional staff accounts. And you get better rates on shipping and insurance discounts, as well as slightly lower transaction fees. If you want all the key features you need to run the heck out of your small business online, Shopify Advanced will tick the boxes. It comes in at $299 per month and has seamless reporting features, incredible sales tracking tools, and slightly lower transaction fees again. If you're a small business looking to scale up, this is the plan for you. Then lastly, we have Shopify Plus, and I'm not going to even go into what it offers. It's it's definitely for enterprise level organizations and costs $2,000 per month. You've got to get a year long subscription and is pretty irrelevant to small businesses. So yeah, those price tags are pretty hefty in comparison to lots of website builders. Shopify is very impressive and will really take care of e-commerce businesses. But more recently, a lot of other builders have caught up to Shopify's offering with their own sales features and they cost less. It all depends on how focused you are on sales and what exact features you might need. We now come to the runners up position, second place in our top five website builders for small businesses. You've probably heard of it, and for good reason, it's Squarespace. Squarespace is slick. The best looking website builder templates on the market come from Squarespace. If I was scoring specifically on aesthetics, it would be tens across the board with Squarespace. Currently, they have 168 templates, and although that's not as many as Wix, they're all really eye-catching, so stylish. You've got a decent range of customer support options with Squarespace, offering both phone and email-based support. There's also a super comprehensive knowledge center that's insights trump the competition of the likes of Square Online. The actual features on offer for your site are vast. We've got SEO tools, including best practice prompts and keyboard support, in-depth and analytics, which help you understand user behaviors, and there are nifty tools for email and social marketing that help you design content with a few clicks of a button. Squarespace Space clearly pride themselves in being one of the key leaders and innovators of the website builder world. Their staff post monthly updates on the providers forum, updating on the progress and changes they're implementing. A recent update included the ability to sell access to your videos. They're always thinking ahead, which is a huge benefit as all businesses looking to grow should be doing the same, right? The reason Squarespace doesn't quite hit our top spot this time around is mainly due to its AI tool. In comparison to our winner, which we'll get to in just a second, Squarespace isn't quite there. There are some good capabilities, sure, like generating text from prompts, but you can't build your site at the click of a couple of buttons like you can with our winner, or even a cheap option like Hostinger. Not great if you're looking for a quick turnaround. Another bit of a shocker with Squarespace is their fairly slow site speeds. It seems like a hefty feature catalog comes at a cost there, and site speed impacts your SEO, keep that in mind. Finally, on pricing. There are a few plans to choose from, and they're all pretty fair value. All Squarespace plans include hosting, a one-year domain, 24-7 support, plus unlimited storage and bandwidth. You can start out with a personal plan at $16 a month, which will give you standard basic features to get you live. The business plan costs $23 a month. It's made for businesses and comes with a few extra marketing features. But if you're in e-commerce, the basic plan starts at $27 per month, and allows you to sell unlimited products with a few simple features. Then there's the advanced plan, 
which comes in at $49 a month. It has all the more complex features and will help you grow your business most quickly. If you're interested in Squarespace, a reminder to make sure to check out the discount code in our description to save some money when you sign up. Okay, ready for our winner? The highest ranked website builder rounding out our big five? Well, our top recommendation for a website builder, if you're a small business, is Wix. Wix are known for their incredibly powerful website builder platform. At this point, they're a household name and are top of the pile in the market. Every positive another website builder has, Wix has it too. And it's probably better. Do you want customizable templates like Squarespace? Well, Wix has over 800 covering any website you could think of compared to Squarespace's 168. Are you after a powerful AI like Shopify has on offer with Shopify Magic? Wix has an AI site generator that works from a single prompt as well as Wix ADI, an artificial intelligence design platform that helps speed up the website process. Wix wins. In comparison to other website builders like Hostinger, Wix offers a lot of value for small businesses across the board with one of the most intuitive, feature-rich platforms on the market. And the help and support they offer is strong. There's 24-7 phone support available, as well as support via social media and live chat. Wix has a few different things on offer in comparison to its competitors. This one's a bit specific, but hear me out. Wix lets you set triggers for actions, like sending an email when certain events take place on your site. So for example, you can set it up to an abandoned cart email reminding customers to check out, or you can use the automation to populate a Google Sheets or even create a task. That kind of automation is unheard of. When you start with Wix, everything is super straightforward. If you don't have much tech capability, no problem, it's a breeze to use. Wix's SEO toolkit is really strong. They have a partnership with the SEO industry renowned tool SEMrush, which gives users access to over 21 billion keywords to target, showing you what real people are searching for so you can create content that meets your audience's needs. The revised search optimization settings give businesses greater control over their SEO data too. Wix helps optimize your business for Google rankings as much as possible. With almost 92% of all web traffic going through Google, it makes sense to go with Wix here. There isn't much for Wix to improve in, in all honesty. It's really good value for money. Sure, users will pay more for Wix than they will for, say, Hostinger, but you get so many more useful features. Plus, Wix offers a solid free plan that can get you started if you want to test the water. Wix pricing starts at $16 per month for a standard site, to showcase your portfolio or share info and imagery. You'll have to pay $27 per month if you want e-commerce functionality, which will let you create an online store. The absolute highest price you could pay for Wix is on the Business Elite plan, which is set up for the fastest growing businesses with 15 staff accounts. It's made for e-commerce future giants. That comes in at $159 a month, which for their top tier package is pretty reasonable. So Wix is the all-rounder that's top of our list. Every website builder we've gone through today has its strengths for sure, but Wix, they know what they're doing. There's a good variety of templates, the ease of use, especially with the AI integrations is off the charts. The price won't break the bank and the SEO support it offers is just super strong. We've got a discount code for Wix in the description below to help you save money on your subscription if you're interested. And remember, if you're still not sure which website builder is right for you, we've got you covered with a quiz to match you up with the right set for you, as well as codes for our other top picks. Depending on what you need, any one of these website builders could be right for you and your online journey. It ultimately comes down to your specific requirements and how much you're looking to spend. Okay. That's a wrap on me for today. I would honestly love it if you could fill us in on your experiences with these website builders in the comments, what works for you and which one of them are you using? We're a community here, so the more you can share, the more we can help each other out. Thanks so much for taking the time to check out this video. Don't miss out on our next video. Hit the subscribe button and switch on those notifications or visit tech.co for more info on the latest tech for small businesses. Until then, remember every business is a tech business and have yourself a great day.